Dear people of science, when I am floating in a bathtub, are my pelvic organs floating inside of me? That may be a dumb question, but I'm trying to figure out why does a bath, hot or cold, help me with pelvic pain more than morphine? And the only thing I can think of is that I'm not subjecting them to be victims of gravity. Right now, it just feels like my uterus is bobbing about. And the second I get out of the tub, it's like, ah, I'm gonna kill you again in the tub, no. So many people with endometriosis and adenomyosis say the same thing, but I'm trying to think about this logically and your bitch ain't about biology or waterology, <laughs> okay? They call me Jessica's wet, but I don't know shit about my internal organs float. It's not my fire when I be in it. Because if I took a Tupperware container in here right now that was sealed and I put sprinkles in the bottom, when I put it into the water, it would stay on the bottom of the Tupperware container. But if that container leaked and oxygen went out of it, then those fucking sprinkle sparkles would float to the top of the water. So I'm sitting here going, okay, so is my abdominal cavity like a sealed off piece of oxygen area, location area, area? And um, so stuff is all still victim to gravity or is there a level of buoyancy just because my whole body is buoyant so my organs are lighter? Or like, are you telling me that like when I get in the tub, all the oxygen, oxygen expo ex escapes through my skin and like now they're just like sloshing around in there and then when I get it, I don't know. Wait, I'm not sealed off. Wait hold on wait what can water can go in my badge up my cervix into my uterus through the to tubes and then your tubes aren't connected to your ovaries so can the water just start squirting about in my abdominal cavity does water not do that is the only reason sperm gets up that cervix because it's on a mission it has some propelling force to it because water can seep in anywhere. Like, you ever flooded your house and ripped off the baseboards? It's crazy. And every time I get out of the tub, I'm packing like two liters that's just gonna expel itself randomly when I'm sitting on the couch in the living room. I'm literally like a camel with my cunt. I'm a cunt camel.